they directly agreed to duel on the spot. Buster slowly loaded his bullets, calmly pondering why there were so many people looking for death every day. He was going to open a business for himself to kill people for a fee. After all, bullets cost money too. After they took their places on the street, the man in black asked Buster. He did not even finish his sentence, only to feel something wrong in his head when he saw a wisp of black smoke coming from the muzzle of the black man's gun across the street. He was immediately confused, then he took off his head gravely, seeing a round hole in the front of the hat. There was also a hole at the back of the head with blood around. Oh my god! It's over! It's all over! Buster took out the mirror to check his wound, then he fell straightly to the ground. The man in black put away his pistol and walked over to Buster's body with whistling leisurely. He kicked the body of the old ape calmly away. Finally, the soul of the Buster flew out of his body, waving its wings, 